First, we begin with breaking news in the Bronx. Two women caught in crossfire while riding an MTA bus. Police say it all started with an argument on the street. Eyewitness News reporter Morgan Norwood is in Melrose as police search for the shooter. Morgan. Yeah, and Joe, police are still sweeping the bus right behind me. As you mentioned, police don't believe they were the intended targets. They're simply on the bus riding, trying to get where they were trying to go. Instead, they say a fight broke out across the street. Shots rang out. Bus caught in the crossfire. Uh, let's get you to the scene. Police say the shots went off just before 3.30. Our cameras arrived shortly after as police were seen setting out markers on the bus. You can also see bullets or bullet uh, a hole, bullet holes going through that window. Officers were also seen fanning out on 156th Street. That is where additional markers were spread out all afternoon long though we've been talking with witnesses some telling me they heard the gunshots others describing the shock they rang out like three times and there was a little pause and then another two or three again so I thought there was some celebration so we're over there I didn't know they were coming from this I never thought I thought it was in a the movie theater like a movie shot that I, I feel I feel bad. I feel like like my life was in, in danger. So I, I told the, the owner here to lock the door so that we lock ourselves inside here. So here's where police say the investigation stands at this hour. They say at least one man took off from the scene in a red car. No arrest at this point. We are so we're also hearing from NYC Transit. The president says this is another reminder that gun violence has no place in our city. He's adding that he's grateful that no passengers were seriously hurt. All of this still under investigation. We'll continue to give you the latest both on air and online. For now, I'm Morgan Norwood from the Bronx, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.